So friends, I am Saurabh. Let's have a look at another common problem today which is level order traversal of a binary tree. So the problem statement is, we have to print nodes of a binary tree level by level. Let's understand the problem through one example. So consider the following tree. So level 1 contains one element which is node 1. Level 2 contains two element which is node 2 and 3. Level 3 contains three nodes, node 4, 5 and 6 and level 4 contains two nodes node 7 and 8. So level order traversal for this tree would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So algorithm for this problem is the solution uses a queue. We first add root to the queue. Now second step is till the queue is not empty we repeat the following steps. We get a node from the queue and print it. If the node has left child we add the left child to the queue. If the node has right child we add the right child to the queue. Let us try to visualize the algorithm through one simple animation. So we have the tree as follows and we have one empty queue. So we execute our first step which is adding root to the queue. So we added one to the queue. We move on to step two where we first check whether queue is empty or not. So it is not empty. So we get a node from the queue and we print it. So node one gets printed. After that we move on to next step where we add left child so 2 gets added to the queue and in next step 3 gets added to the queue. We move on to second iteration of step 2 where again we check whether queue is not empty it is not empty and we delete a node from the queue and we print it so that is why 2 gets printed and we then add it 4 and 5 which are left and right child of node 2. Then we move on to next step where we check whether queue is not empty, it's not empty. So that is why we deleted node 3 and we printed it and we added node 6 since it had only one child. We move on to next iteration where we delete node 4. Since 4 is leaf node, nothing gets added to queue. Now in next iteration, node 5 gets deleted and nodes 7 and 8 gets added to the queue. Similarly, we execute our next steps. Now since nodes 6, 7 and 8 are leaf nodes, so nothing will get added to queue. So first 6 gets printed, in next iteration 7 gets printed and in final iteration node 8 gets printed. Now Q is empty here so our execution stops here and the final output is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 which is level order traversal of the tree. The time complexity of the algorithm is order of n because we traverse all three nodes once. The space complexity is order of n since we are using a queue to store nodes of the tree. Let's quickly run through the code. So we initialize one queue we first add root to the queue and while queue is not empty we delete the node from the queue and if the node has left or right child we add those to the queue. We do this operation while queue is not empty. Which all tree traversal algorithms would you like to see in subsequent topics? Let us know how we can improve on our visualization techniques as well. Please let us know your valuable suggestions on current topic. If you like our video, please subscribe to iDeserve channel, like the video and share it with your friends. Thank you.